The James Webb Space Telescope is upsetting the apple cart. All of a sudden, we realize that we may have to rewrite all the textbooks about the beginning of the universe. Also known as Webb or JWST, this remarkable telescope has not only astounded us with its revelations about stars, planets, galaxies, and other cosmic phenomena, but has set new standards for scientific excitement. It has been a year since the formidable James Webb Space Telescope graced us with its inaugural historic image of the universe, leaving astronomers worldwide in awe of its extraordinary detail. However, the telescope's most recent discovery paints a chilling picture of the cosmos, one that has never been seen before. Join us on this cosmic journey as we explore the depths of space with the James Webb Space Telescope, unraveling the mysteries it has uncovered. Has it posed more questions than answers for scientists? What terrifying image of the universe has it unveiled? Together, let's embark on a quest to comprehend the profound revelations brought forth by the James Webb Space Telescope. The successor to the renowned Hubble Space Telescope has unveiled new details about star formation, galaxy mergers, and the early moments of Earth's cosmos, just a month after the release of its first images. The extraordinary photos have captured the essence of the universe, paving the way for a remarkable series of discoveries that have enriched scientists with a precious treasure trove of data. Recordings from the James Webb Space Telescope focused on phenomena such as cosmic tarantulas, stars on the brink of supernova explosions, and other fascinating celestial objects have been meticulously documented. The cutting-edge technology of this space observatory has allowed us to explore increasingly remote regions of space, revealing details that were previously shrouded in mystery. Thus began a new era of astronomy, thanks to exceptionally detailed images. To celebrate the first year of the James Webb Space Telescope's operation, NASA has shared a fascinating image depicting a small area of star formation within the Rho-Ophiuchi cloud complex. The image captures jets erupting from newborn stars while cosmic dust clouds intertwine. The red of the dust is attributed to molecular hydrogen, and the presence of a circumstellar disk casts shadows on some stars, suggesting the possibility of planetary formation in a distant past. Although the image may appear to depict cosmic chaos, NASA reassures that this stellar nursery is relatively small and peaceful compared to others. Moreover, many of the young stars in this area are the size of our sun, or even smaller, making it the nearest star-forming region to Earth. This captivating shot was captured by the observatory's main camera, the near-infrared camera of the Webb Space Telescope, which captures cosmic images in two distinct infrared spectra simultaneously. The Space Telescope has also contributed to enhancing our understanding of exoplanets, worlds that orbit stars other than our Sun. James Webb has proven particularly adept at observing distant large galaxies, so much so that it identified its first exoplanet, LHS 475b in the early months of 2023. This planet, located 41 light years away, has a diameter similar to that of Earth. According to NASA, James Webb is the only operational telescope capable of analyzing the atmospheres of Earth-sized exoplanets. The results of this discovery highlight the telescope's extraordinary precision, opening new horizons of exploration for astronomers. Subsequently, the James Webb Telescope has found evidence of ancient vanished galaxies, challenging previous theories denying their existence. Evo La of Swinburne University and his global astronomical team identified six massive old galaxies named the Universe Destroyers, whose formation could date back 500 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. Earlier this year, the telescope's infrared sensors revealed their presence. Using these advanced tools, Scientists have been able to peer back in time to about 13.5 billion years ago when stars and galaxies were still young. The enormity of these ancient galaxies has left scientists astonished, as theoretically, they should have been 10, 100 times smaller. Estimates suggest that these six entities could be billions of times more massive than our Sun, and the sum of all the stars in a galaxy could surpass the mass of our Sun by over 100 billion times. Understanding these massive entities and their rapid formation compared to smaller galaxies remains unanswered questions. Joel Leah, an assistant professor of astronomy and astrophysics at Pennsylvania State University and co-author of the study, 
expressed surprise at the discovery of this new category of objects formed in the early universe. The revelation that the formation of massive galaxies began in the very early moments of the universe's history raises fundamental questions about our past understandings. This exceptional discovery seems to defy normalcy, creating stimulating challenges for the scientific community. Doubts now surround the entire process of galaxy formation in the ancient universe much more massive than previously hypothesized. Spectrometry, which separates light into its different wavelengths to allow more precise distance measurements, is essential to validate these results that keep scientists on edge. Only a few objects recently discovered have had confirmations of distance and mass. If these data prove accurate, galaxy formation may have been much more efficient and rapid than previously thought. The exciting possibility that a single instrument could hold the key to understanding cosmic history opens a new chapter of scientific curiosity. While scientists seek to interpret the complex history of the universe, spatial and temporal observations continue to present intriguing contradictions. And Dr. Katie Mack, a cosmologist, offers her perspective to explain these mysteries. Fear not, as Mack has emphasized, the telescope is capturing fascinating images of remote galaxies, which although over 13 billion light years away, appear partially blurred. Doubts arise that, after the Big Bang, the elapsed time may not have been sufficient for the formation of such imposing galaxies, according to dates provided by cosmologists. This situation has raised concerns in the scientific field, prompting questions about various theories, including concepts like dark matter and the Big Bang. To gain certainties, however, it is essential to delve into the available evidence. The telescope gifts spectacular views of nebulas nearby, but shows only blurred points when it comes to remote galaxies. This is because different colors are influenced by various parts of the light spectrum. The Webb telescope can perceive light from a source in two distinct ways, by using a spectrograph, similar to a prism, which disperses light and analyzes the brightness of each color, or by utilizing filters that block everything except a specific range of colors. Comparing this data with the expected spectrum for galaxies with similar features allows calculating the redshift of the galaxy, providing precise information about the epoch of cosmic history being observed. It turns out that many galaxies exhibit an excess of stars or stars that are too young compared to what would be expected from spectral model comparisons. There are several possible explanations for this anomaly. Photometric readings could be erroneous due to issues in the calibration of the telescope, or the observations could be referring to a non-representative galaxy cluster or extremely small regions of the sky. Another explanation could be that spectral models of galaxies are designed for closer galaxies and might not be suitable for those farther away. Conversely, if these galaxies are indeed extremely large and previous estimates are incorrect, cosmologists might have to completely revise our understanding of cosmic evolution. What do you think of this perspective? But this represents only one of the challenges faced by scientists despite technological progress. For instance, the discovery of planets seemingly too massive to exist and a planet orbiting an ultra-cool dwarf star has raised fundamental questions about planetary formation and the architecture of solar systems. A planet 13 times larger than Earth has been identified in orbit around the ultra-cool LHS 3154 star, nine times less massive than our Sun. This discovery has led to a reassessment of theories about planet formation. Before these discoveries, Scientists considered it unlikely for such a massive planet to exist in a planetary system around a low-mass star like LHS 3154. However, reality has exceeded expectations. This compels us to reconsider our theories of stellar and planetary formation. A useful analogy is to compare the star to a bonfire. To maintain your body temperature, you need to get closer to the fire as its temperature decreases. Planets are no different. Planets that want to be warm enough to support liquid water must be closer to stars with lower temperatures. If a planet is in sufficiently tight orbit around an ultra-cool star, we can observe the planet's tug on the starlight, causing a small variation in the star's color. On the other hand, looking up into the sky, a new and fascinating image of the icy giant Uranus has been captured, showing almost all of its dust rings, difficult to photograph in the past. 
This shot is the work of the James Webb Space Telescope. For the fainter rings, seen only by Voyager 2 in space until now, the image represents an extraordinary demonstration of the telescope's sensitivity. Uranus, located 1.2 billion miles from the Sun, has 13 recognized rings, 11 of which are visible in the new stunning image from the Webb Space Telescope. Unlike Saturn's horizontal rings, the particular sideways tilt of this planet makes its rings appear vertical. The two outer rings were not spotted until the Voyager 2 flyby in 1986, due to their dusty composition, which made them less visible and more challenging to photograph. The nine main rings were already known, but in 2007, NASA's Hubble Space Telescope revealed the existence of two additional faint outer rings, unfortunately not visible in the photos acquired by the Webb Telescope. Scientists are confident that the Webb has the potential to capture these additional rings. Analyzing a planet's ring system provides crucial information about its genesis and origin. Uranus, characterized by an inclined orbit and the absence of internal heat, is a planet with peculiar features, making any information about its past highly valuable. The unique atmospheric composition of the gas giant Uranus is an enigma that scientists hope the telescope can resolve, as no other instrument of this magnitude has been able to explore infrared light in detail. The JWST offers a new perspective for examining Neptune and Uranus. Unlike telescopes using visible light such as Hubble, the Webb Space Telescope can reveal features and details previously invisible through infrared imaging. In addition, the James Webb Space Telescope has captured an extraordinary video of a star nearing its end, released at the end of 2021. The image of the dying star represents one of the first flawless recordings of this kind. The massive Wolf Rayet 124 star was observed expelling gas and dust into space through the telescope's infrared lens. This celestial phenomenon is believed to be occurring 15,000 light years from Earth, a distance equivalent to about 5.8 trillion miles. The image, exclusively provided by NASA, shows the bright violet remnant of the star's outer layer, once a mass of dust and gas that contributed to the star's brightness. This impressive photo represents an improvement over that captured by the Hubble telescope in space a few years ago, in 2015, before the JWST launch. The transitioning star was recorded by Hubble as a fiery ball, but the technology of the time could not capture finer details, giving it a very different appearance. However, the destruction caused by Wolf Rayet 124 is now clearly visible. This exploded star, located in the Sagittarius constellation, is believed to be 30 times larger than our sun and has expelled enough gas and dust to temporarily obscure the light of 10 suns. According to NASA, the light from a star at the center of this new and extraordinary image has traveled through space for 15,000 years, and it will take another 15,000 years to reach the telescope's detectors. The dust surrounding the central star is indeed dust, released when a star dies and expels its outer layers into space. The dispersed dust in space becomes the material from which new planets will form, contributing to our existence. Experts speculate that this star, in the process of ejecting material, is about to undergo the phenomenon known as a supernova. Although the collapse of Wolf Rayet 124 will be invisible to the human eye, Nevertheless, it will be possible to see five planets from Earth during this event. In deep space, the James Webb Telescope has captured a fascinating spectral entity, actually a galaxy that consistently generates hundreds of new stars every year, demonstrating that appearances can be deceiving. The galaxy, designated Aztec C71, was discovered almost 10 years ago by a ground-based telescope but disappeared when examined by the more advanced Hubble Space Telescope. Thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, this Schrodinger galaxy has triumphantly reappeared. The artistic representation shows the Aztec C-71 galaxy, seemingly screaming into the abyss with what appear to be two eyes and an open mouth. This discovery revolutionizes the scientific understanding of the early years of the universe and suggests that large, star-forming centers may have been three to ten times more common than initially anticipated. Thanks to the team's calculations, the redshift of this galaxy is about six, 
placing it approximately 900 million years after the Big Bang. This small object represents a significant puzzle in our understanding of galactic evolution. The regularity of star formation observed in Aztec, C-71 challenges existing models and prompts astronomers to reevaluate the factors influencing the birth of stars in the early universe. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues its mission, scientists eagerly anticipate more revelations about the cosmos. The telescope's ability to peer deep into space, capture high-resolution images, and provide insights into various celestial phenomena positions it as a crucial tool for advancing our understanding of the universe. The discoveries made by the telescope, from ancient galaxies to planetary systems around ultra-cool stars, open avenues for further exploration and inquiry. As the scientific community grapples with unexpected findings and challenges previously held assumptions, the James Webb Space Telescope stands as a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. In the coming years, the telescope's observations will likely lead to breakthroughs in our understanding of the cosmos, unraveling more mysteries and pushing the boundaries of what we thought possible. The James Webb Space Telescope represents a beacon of curiosity, guiding humanity into a future where the enigmas of the universe are gradually illuminated by the light of discovery.